Well, hello and welcome to my reaction video for The Mandalorian. This is the final trailer, the final, final promotional push for this very exciting new Star Wars TV show set to hit the upcoming Disney Plus streaming service for those few lucky bastards out there who are actually getting it, which is not us here in the United Kingdom, so you can rest assured there will be a legal streaming galore going on with this TV show. And I may or may not be a healthy proponent of that said illegal streaming. But look guys, I'll just dive right into this trailer because I'm very excited to see what's going on under the surface here. That very familiar shot. Is the world more peaceful since the revolution? No, turn turn. That your people suffered. Magnificent looking. Oh, very cool. Oh, oh. But bounty hunting is a complicated profession. Yes, indeed. Seen that shot before. They said you were the best in the Parsec. Would you agree? He may not, but he certainly looks like he does. Mean business. <laughs> wow. Carol Wells. Look outside. They are waiting for you. Oba. Yeah. Good. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm. I'm so on board for it now. It's. I, I didn't have to see the trail to be honest with you. I, they could just give me this, and I would. I can consume it. No matter what, um, it's just it's just incredible looking. It looks as though it's managed to garner the very essence of the original trilogy, Star Wars. That one, everyone in their granny seems to love the most. Unless you were some little child born in the 1990s or something who's very confused and thinks prequels are better. This looks incredible. It looks weathered. And it's just that concept of diving into the dark, deep recesses of... That galaxy far, far away, the outer rim, where oh, you have all these nefarious, scruffy looking nerf herders, if you'd like, kicking around in the shadows. Just this lawless state, this concept of bringing a western in and amalgamating it with Star Wars, it looks wonderful. Pedro Pascal, we get to hear the man speak at the end, he's an incredible actor. I thoroughly enjoyed him in Game of Thrones, perhaps one of my favourite characters that season. And uh, it's a real shame the way he went out in that one. But look, he's getting a chance to lead the... I'm uh, getting a chance to lead a Star Wars show because it's not the Star Wars show anymore. We have several other ones in the pipeline. But look, and just a whole host of other famous faces in there. You've got the likes of Carol Weathers. You've got Giancarlo Esposito. Uh, two magnificent actors. He seems to be narrating the vast majority of this trailer. I think it's that what I'm pretty damn sure it was Werner Herzog. Uh, he's got a very distinctive voice. Uh, we see Giancarlo playing that villainous sort of a First Order or Imperial guy. No, no, it just looks wonderful. Looks as though it's been really well thought out. Um, it's totally different to what we've seen in the array of Disney-led movies to this point. And I think that's because it's Dave Filoni and John Favreau who are involved. It's not Kathleen Kennedy. She has passed that baton over to Mr Favreau. It says... That you link up with Dave Filoni and make this happen and you can tell it's just different there's something about it, it feels better it feels like Star Wars, and that's not shitting upon the movies because some of them have been okay, some of them have been excellent Rogue One was excellent for me Force Awakens was okay, the rest mm, can take them or leave them this looks like a different beast, I cannot wait to see it, as I did say before the reaction, it isn't coming here officially until I think May next year, so that is not going to happen, I'm sorry, I will not be waiting seven months to watch this I will be consuming it anyway and 
which I can. Uh, and that is going to round up the video. Well guys, what did you make of that trailer? What do you make of The Mandalorian in general? Are you from the United Kingdom? What the hell do you make of Disney selling us down the river and not giving us a chance to consume this in a legal manner? What did you make of my reaction? If you've got anything to say about anything, you can comment below and let me know what your thoughts were. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying the content. And I'll be back, perhaps with Steven, in the near future for another trailer reaction.